Hello, if like me you've got a solar system and you are not connected to the red then you obviously you will have a pack of batteries and huh, to uh, keep the energy. So in this video I will show you how we're gonna have a look at the batteries and see the state of them. Here as you can see there's a full bank of um, batteries uh, these ones are two volts so there are different ones on the market okay uh, but usually a normal uh, solar system are two volt batteries uh, so this one is a 24 volt system so how do you know you got a problem well it's very easy if your system works fine during summer and winter and all of a sudden poof, the electricity cuts and cuts and cuts then you know one of them or maybe more uh, fail huh? so uh, that's what we're going to be checking now uh, just to make sure you don't damage them huh? make sure you check the level of water huh? it's it's written maximum and minimum make sure you put place distilled water and that the water is always kept at a good level okay now i'll show you how to test them the first test we will do will be with um, something like that huh? and we'll set it off in volts and in 20 okay because the batteries are 2 volts so I go above I go in 20 volts okay and then we we'll test them each and single one of them and normally it doesn't matter if you test them in the morning or in the afternoon etc they should all of them more or less huh, uh, have the same voltage if one drops considerably you know that one is has a problem okay so let's check that first one so we should have above 2 volts I hope you'll be able to see okay this one is 221 can you see it let's check the second one 220 okay so we're not good third one this one 117 can you see so this one has a problem let's check this one 220 this one 221 okay so I know all those ones are good I won't test them all because obviously I know which one is failing okay I know it's this one and so that's the first way to check that you've got a problem now uh, we're gonna do another test just to make sure the other way to test them is with a battery tester huh, like this one uh, make sure it fits in your element huh, like this one on one side it marks 0, 50%, 100% so when you, you test it, it should be always at 100% uh, maybe a little bit less depending of the uh, of the weather okay and on the other side you've got the acidity level okay so let's check it so it should never be at zero huh? the, when the water comes in never be at zero so let's check this one I hope you'll see it okay you can see the water level 100% that's perfect now that's the battery we have a problem with there we go see water level here at zero it drops okay in case we try it again again it marks zero okay so this one is definitely to be changed we'll try the third one okay you can see 100 percent no problem okay so you do this with all your batteries and then uh, eventually you know the the multimeter and the battery tester will tell you for sure that this is to be changed now you know how to check your batteries and I hope you won't have to change any uh, because these are quite expensive to replace uh, these ones that I've got cost about 400 to 450 a piece uh, so quite pricey uh, but if you need to change it don't throw it away there are companies that will recycle them uh, they, for instance one of those dead they will uh, buy it from me 30 to 40 euro a piece uh, so if you've got several ones that are out uh, well the money always comes handy eh? um, well until then i hope that you have liked the video and take care of yourself ciao